Hey Gemini, so my name is Kianti Ashe and this is Blue Aura Healing Guidance and Tarot. This message is going to be for Geminis, okay? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, whatever house you have it in, South Node, North Node, doesn't matter. If you have it anywhere on your charts, then this is for you, okay? So let us get into it. Messages for our Gemini spirit. What messages do we have at this time for our Geminians? messages we have okay all right failure okay failure so gemini let me just go and say this to you you're not a failure okay just because something doesn't work out the way that you would have liked it to as my mom always tells me does not mean that you have failed right does not mean that you have to completely disregard the plan i talked to you guys about this last month sometimes you just have to add an extra step or two or three or however many you feel is necessary or you deem necessary rather whatever right the challenge right now for you is also grief okay dealing with grief some of you may feel like you've lost something or someone maybe a connection But there is this need for you to utilize your willpower here. To exercise what you know when it comes to certain spiritual things here. Such as your happiness is up to you. Okay. And grief It can be really heavy if we let it sit, right? But this is for some of you who are of service here because service popped out. So you're a giver. You're someone who perhaps works with children, works with elderly, or works with the public in some way, shape, form, or fashion. You may be um, a first responder. Some of you. Okay, some of you could have responded to a situation and really wanted to help the individual. And the individual wasn't able to make it. And you're holding that against yourself. Spirit wants for you to let that go. Okay. Now that part. Not everybody's part. Okay. Courage. That's your focus. Okay. Spirit wants you to understand that not everybody can do what you do. Okay. How you do it. Etc. Etc. So have the courage to go, you know, into situations boldly. You know, as a first responder for whoever you are that went through that situation. Not many people have the courage to do that type of job. To show up first to the fire. To show up first to the accident. To show up first, you know, to any scene. Okay? Nobody has, no, not everybody has that courage. Okay? So, Spirit is saying, whoever you are, whoever I'm speaking to, and a lot of Geminis do, have great imagination skills and, you know, creative skills and all of that stuff so this is spirit's way of saying instead of you focusing on you know this failure or this grief that you're feeling you know allow yourself to continue to be of service recognize the courage that you have recognize the beauty of your imagination and creative skills because you can create a different reality right unfortunately you won't be able to save everybody all the time but that's not what you should focus on your focus should be on that you're being of service doing the best that you can and showing up courageously every single day to get the job done okay so with failure it says i understand that a mistake is only an opportunity to learn okay so now that didn't work out the way you would have liked it to what can we do to make this better okay this didn't you know last month wasn't as great as every other month. Well, what can I do to make this thing better? Sometimes we stand in our own way because we don't want to be flexible. Spirit is saying, you know, it's okay. Be flexible. Once again, that part, not everybody's part. Take what applies where and put it where it needs to go. Okay? Grief. I understand that losing something is an opportunity to appreciate it. Okay? So for some of you, like I said, this is a connection. For others of you, that other situation that I was talking about. Okay? But regardless to what? People come into your lives... You guys give each other what you're supposed to get out of that contract, that situation, and then you move forward. Sometimes people move forward with you. Sometimes you move forward in one direction and they move forward in another. 
either way, you both move forward, right? Sometimes, not both of you, but either way, as long as you're not staying stagnant and keeping this heavy emotion on you, that's all that matters, right? So then, moving forward, right, you're being guided to continue to be of service, continue to give to others. So it says, I feel good when I can help others, okay? Instead of you allowing yourself to sit in these heavy emotions, continue to give, continue to show up, continue to be courageous, okay? Courage. I find the inner strength to face fear with confidence. Yeah, you may have felt like you failed. You may have felt like you lost something, but you still showed up. You still continued. You still persisted, okay? Then imagination. I embrace and nourish the creative aspect of my mind, all right? So you can create whatever type of situation or reality you want here, Gemini. Underline the energy, happiness. Beautiful way they could bring that together. I am aware that being happy means that I am on the right path. So like I said before, that is a decision, right? That is a choice. So what choice do you make? Okay, let's use the Tarot of Dreams for you guys today. If you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. I would absolutely love to have you back as a part of the growing family. And yes, you guys, you already know it's that time where all the seasons are changing. Especially if you're anywhere near where I am, you know what I'm talking about. Because this weather here is interesting. I'll say that. Very interesting. Messages for Gemini. Spirit. Okay. A lot of you are in hermit mode, taking time away to think, put things into perspective for yourself, to really figure out what way you want to move forward. Some of you may be um, finding yourself, anytime you interact with people, okay, these emotions, that these heavy emotions that you're feeling, okay, because a lot of you feel like, whew, this is getting good. Let me just pick these cards out for you guys real quick. Okay, that's exactly what I'm getting here. We, we already we already did the oracle, so we already know where this is going, so don't be scared. We have the Knight of Coins. Knight of Coins is someone who's on a mission, but he takes his time to get there, right? Nice and steady, right? The Hermit is someone who either takes time away from people, takes time to think, put things into perspective, figure out what he wants to do next, she wants to do next, they want to do next, right? The Strength card in reverse. A person who is having a difficult time with healing, right? So healing the feeling of failure, healing the feeling of grief. And so when you interact with people, when you interact with society, you tend to say things that you don't necessarily mean, do things that you wouldn't necessarily do. And so spirit is guiding you to kind of pull back the reins a little bit. Pause. Take this time alone. Don't necessarily be around too many people, you know. Yes, continue to be of service. But make sure that you're nurturing your mind. Remember that imagination card, right? I embrace and nourish the creative aspect of my mind. If right now everything you're thinking about is grief and failure, grief and failure, you don't want to put that energy out into the world. Because then that, that continues to come back to you, right? So with this eight of coins here in reverse, this is your focus. That's what I'm saying. You don't want to, yes, continue to be of service. Absolutely. That's what spirit wants you to do. But when you're feeling how you're feeling, right? And like I said, you're in that type of field. Are you doing more good than harm by feeling that way and still showing up, you know? Or should you allow yourself the ability or the time to heal? Not the ability, the time, you guys, to heal. Should you allow yourself the time to heal? Should you allow yourself those few days? Doesn't have to be like, you know, taking a year off, right? But just because of the hanging man here, your mind is still going to be on it, right? And you're going to beat yourself up about it. But it's okay. It's okay. Like, this thing that happened here, you guys, for the first responders that I'm talking to, because this is you, okay? This is you right now, but this will be you soon. And you will be able to go out there and continue doing what spirit needs you to do. But while you are feeling like this, okay, it's not the best for you to continue to invest yourself into that type of field. You won't necessarily have your mind all the way in the game is what I'm getting here, okay? Let's pick some. Let's pick some of these babies for you guys but that's really what i'm getting eight of coins in reverse just lets me know like i said 
it's not something you want to do right now, okay? It involves work. Some of you feel like you don't want to do this type of work anymore. But Spirit wants you to continue to be of service. So maybe not that type of work. Like I said, maybe you're not a failure because you feel like you don't want to do that type of work anymore. And that's what you started out doing. Or well, maybe Spirit wants you to do something different then. Okay, once again, not everybody's message still so applies to you. Okay, but I don't want you to beat yourself up about how you're feeling right now. say that spirit knows best so just let it happen how it's going to happen <clears throat> wondrous universe walk in beauty walk knowing that you're here to be of service okay however give yourself the necessary time to heal do not be hard on yourself do not feel like you failed it says keep going forward ascending the mountain this feeling shall pass right these feelings See? Overcoming obstacles. You can overcome anything. Alright? At the bottom, wandering path. Enjoy the journey. So, it's not about, you know, <laughs> failing spirit. You know, spirit, you wanted me to do this. You wanted me to help people. You wanted me to be of service. And I don't feel like I'm doing it. I don't feel like I'm getting it. I don't feel like it's happening. You know, spirit is saying, well, just keep going forward. You know, I, I see the bigger picture here. And so, I want you to just walk in beauty. Walk in, walk in what I need you to do. Be of service. And this obstacle will subside, you know, this fear, this worry, this doubt, this grief, this feeling of failure, all of that stuff subside, okay? So if you haven't, go ahead, like this video, and I'll see you guys soon. Peace out.